The Omicron variant is now confirmed in more than two dozen states, and officials are responding with more mitigation efforts. Jonathan Sari has the latest from Atlanta. Omicron is on the move. The COVID variant is the most contagious we've seen so far. It's now been reported in more than two dozen states as it spreads rapidly across the country. We're averaging more than 119,000 new cases every day in the U.S., the highest number since September. But health officials are stressing Omicron is not fueling this new surge. Over 99% of cases in this country right now are caused by the Delta variant which is driving increases in cases and hospitalizations. The spike in cases is prompting new mitigation efforts just days after a vaccine mandate for all private employers was announced in New York City. Governor Kathy Hochul put a statewide mask mandate in place for indoor spaces not requiring vaccinations. Business owners say it will put more pressure on their bottom line, but officials say it's the best way to stop the spread. Every time we've put a mandate in place, Chris, it has worked. That's why the city is open and thriving. Meanwhile, more businesses are dropping vaccine requirements after the president's nationwide mandate was put on hold by a federal judge. The White House says it expects that ruling to eventually be overturned. But mandate opponents claim they'll keep on fighting. It's not about, you know, whether you're pro or anti-vaccine. It's about whether you believe the president can mandate this. And we clearly believe he can't. Healthcare providers are also starting to drop vaccine requirements. Right now, only about 42% of hospitals have a mandate in place. In Atlanta, Jonathan Seri, Fox News.